Former U.S. President Donald Trump has said that his Florida home was raided by the FBI and that agents broke open a safe. Mr. Trump said in a statement that his home in Palm Beach was occupied by a large group of FBI agents. The search was reportedly connected to an investigation into Mr. Trump's handling of official papers. U.S. media reports that the search is related to documents which the president may have taken to his home on leaving the White House. Mr. Trump's lawyer told some news outlets that some papers had been seized during the search. The dramatic escalation of law enforcement scrutiny of Trump comes as he prepares for a possible presidential run in 2024. The FBI declined to comment on whether the search was happening or what it might be for, nor did Trump give any indication of why federal agents were at his home. Trump said in a statement posted on his Truth social network that these are dark times for our nation as my beautiful home in Florida is currently under siege, raided and occupied by a large group of FBI agents. Multiple U.S. media outlets cited sources close to the investigation as saying that agents were conducting a court-authorized search related to potential mishandling of classified documents that had been sent to Mar-a-Lago. The National Archives said in February it had recovered 15 boxes of documents from Trump's Florida estate, which the Washington Post reported included highly classified texts taken with him when he left Washington following his re-election defeat. The documents and momentos, which also included correspondence from ex-US President Barack Obama, should by law have been turned over at the end of Trump's presidency, but instead ended up at Trump's resort. The recovery of the boxes raised questions about Trump's adherence to presidential record laws enacted after the 1970s Watergate scandal that require Oval Office occupants to preserve records related to administration activity. The National Archives of America had requested then that the Justice Department open a probe into Trump's practices. According to a forthcoming book by New York Times reporter Maggie Haberman, White House staff also regularly discovered warts of paper clogging toilets, leading them to believe Trump was trying to get rid of certain documents.